Round two play of the 2024 PGA Championship was delayed Friday after a fatal accident in which a pedestrian was struck and killed by a shuttle bus near the entrance of Valhalla Golf Club in Louisville, Kentucky. A relentless Xander Schauffele tied the record again for the lowest score in a men's major championship round on Thursday, carding a flawless 9-under par 62 in the first round of the PGA Championship in Louisville. Today will be an impact day for the potential of strong, severe storms later this morning. Strong storms in the panhandle are racing towards CFL. This will lead to an increase in storms for our northern locations this a.m. Arrival of the storms will be between 10 a and 1 p. After 10 a, there will be the threat of a strong, severe storm. Wind, hail, and tornadoes cannot be ruled out. Depending on heating, there may be another round of strong storms later in the afternoon. There's no one left at the Ripley Police Department. Mayor Travis Arnett said all the police officers have officially resigned. The officers at the Brown County Sheriff's Office are temporarily taking over. Brown County Sheriff Gordon Ellis said the county isn't charging the village in good faith. Scheffler's golf skills have been well documented the past few seasons. The two-time reigning PGA Tour Player of the Year is on his way to a three-peat of that award and putting up ball-striking stats the likes of which we've only seen from Tiger Woods. For that reason, Scheffler is the overwhelming favorite to win this week's PGA Championship. Good evening and welcome to Press Key. I'm your host. Tiger Woods knows he's competitively rusty, compared to the vast majority of this week's PGA Championship field. That doesn't mean he expects any less of himself, Woods opened the 106th PGA Championship in 1 over 72, a mixed bag of a morning in Louisville, Kentucky. He battled through a series of wayward tee shots to remain around par through the majority of his opening round at Valhalla Golf Club, and he caught fire midway through his second nine to move into red figures. Woods, though, closed with back-to-back three-putt bogeys that will leave a sour taste in his mouth overnight. He's ten strokes off the pace of Xander Schofel, who carded nine under 62 to begin the week, the PGA Championship single-round record low score, the day resembled his first round at last month's Masters, 1 over 73, with an up-and-down cadence but an end result that should fall near the projected cut line. Woods followed with a second-round 72 at the Masters to make the cut, setting a tournament record with his 24th straight made cut. He'll look Friday to play the weekend for a second straight major championship, aiming for a faster start than he accomplished Thursday. It took me probably three holes to get back into competitive flow again and get a feel for hitting the ball out there in competition, adrenaline, temperatures, green speeds, Wood said after his opening round. These are all things that normally I adjust to very quickly, and it just took me a few holes to get into it. I am getting stronger for sure, each day is a little bit different. Some days, it's better than others. It's just the way it is. My body is just that way. Some days, it feels great, and other days, a bit of a struggle. Woods' history echoes throughout the grounds at Valhalla, as his 2000 PGA Championship victory here marked the third leg of the Tiger Slam, which he completed at the 2001 Masters. Woods won the 2000 US Open and the Open by a combined 23 shots, before the wily veteran May gave him all he could handle for 75 holes at Valhalla. It might be a tall task to expect Woods to hoist another Wanamaker trophy this weekend, but making the cut for a second straight major championship is certainly in the realm. Major championships are a long grind. It's just plodding along. It's not a sprint. It's just a grind, you can't win a tournament unless you make the cut. That's the whole idea is get to the weekend so that you can participate and have a chance to win. I've been on the cut number and have won tournaments, 
or I've been ahead and leading tournaments and I've won tournaments. But you have to get to the weekend in order to win a golf tournament. That's all for tonight. Stay tuned to Press Key for the latest updates. Signing off.